Our academic all-star this week comes to us from Potsdam Central School District. Today, we welcome Viola Partridge. Thank you very much for making the trip in. Thank you for having me. Absolutely, and congratulations on being our academic all-star this week. Thank you so much. Oh, well, you've got to be pretty smart. Do you have any idea what your grade point average is and where you rank in your class? My school doesn't announce class rank, but my unweighted average is a 99.03. And you are at the top of your class, uh, somewhere up there. Yes, yeah. I received an award for being in the top five from okay. the Elks Lodge. So we, we know you're at least in the top five <laughs> yes. uh, of your class. What are you involved in in school? I'm involved in our three honor societies, National Honor Society, National Art Honor Society, and National French Honor Society. I've also performed in three productions at the Drama Club. I'm in the Artistic Congress, and the French Club, and the Environmental Club. Let's break some of these down. Uh, what is Artistic Congress? Artistic Congress is a club where basically once a week um, we provide an art opportunity for students whether they're in an art class or not. So that can be like making ceramics or making jewelry or doing different crafts like that. Um, and it's really fun and students have the opportunity to work on projects even if they don't have the opportunity in class. So you are an artist? I would say so maybe. <laughs> yeah, so what is your art of choice? Do you prefer painting, sculpture, ceramics? I mean, what, what's your... I like to watercolor, but I make jewelry. Oh, you also make jewelry. Mm -hmm. That's really interesting. Did you make any of the pieces that you're wearing today? I did not. No? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, and you're also involved in Drama Club. Tell us more about some of the parts you've played this past year. Yes. This year I was the lead Elle Woods in Legally Blonde. Um, that must have been a lot of fun. It was so much fun. <laughs> yeah, and you probably had to wear a, bl a blonde wig, right? Yes, it was a lot of hair. <laughs> <laughs> and you were mentioning earlier that you now have a lot of pink in your wardrobe as a result of that part? Yes, definitely. The whole <laughs> tracksuit, everything. <laughs> oh, wow. And what other parts have you played? I've also played Rosie in Mamma Mia, and I was an ensemble member in Annie. So obviously you do sing. Yes, I yeah. do. And, um, what, what's your favorite type of music to sing? Mm -hmm. To sing, I like country music, I think it's fun, but any type of music I enjoy. Just just getting it out, yes, singing, yeah. Exactly. What are your plans for after high school? After high school, I'll be attending university. Um, I'd like to major in business administration or marketing. And you also want to focus on French. Yes. Tell us how you, uh, how you speak French and uh, what inspired you. Yeah, I started taking French in middle school and something just clicked. I was like, this is it for me. So I've been taking it ever since and I also participated in a French exchange and two French immersion programs in Montreal. So you, you've been to Montreal, you've also been to France? Yes. Yeah, do you speak the language fluently? I'm not fluent, but I would definitely like to pursue it in the future. Yeah. So the, the business uh, administration, mm -hmm. business administration, what do you hope to accomplish with that? I would like to work in sustainable or ethical business and fashion companies. That would be the dream. Fashion, Paris, I, I see the link there. Yes, yeah. exactly. <laughs> All right, well, thank you so much for joining us today. Best of luck to you in the future. Thank you so much. We'll be right back.